I am filming the opening to this video, the intro to this video at the very end of the video. So that's why this is going to look a little different because I completely forgot. <laughs> Hi. It's been a while. If I remember correctly, uh, it's been over a year since I've done this. To give a very quick rundown, I have very simply been too sick to film anything. I was bedbound almost at one point, but that's a whole different story. <laughs> um, but I am healthy enough, again, to regularly pick this up, film, upload, and not send my body into crisis mode each time. So we're back. <laughs> This was quite a spontaneous vlog where I just kind of decided, you know what, let me film, see if it is possible for me to even stick to filming an entire video without my POTS, Emmy, or anything else acting up and preventing me from continuing to film. If you're seeing this, that means that the entire video is filmed. A part of it is already also edited. This vlog was filmed over the course of a couple of days where I worked on the sixth draft of At the Mercy of the Devil, which you would have previously known as The Devil of Brooklyn Manor. I decided to go with a new title because it just fits better. <laughs> this is the final draft that I'm doing before I am going to start sending my book to agents. So you're really just following the countdown to me sending out my queries. So I hope that you enjoy and let's just get into the actual vlog. I'm honestly not sure what to say or do. I feel like it's been so long. <laughs> because frankly, I have been too sick to do this. <laughs> I look sick. I just realized that's... I genuinely look sick right now. Don't worry, I'm fine. I'm just in the middle of pan. Which I guess means that I'm not fine, but I'm alive and I'm not bed bound. So to quickly recap, I am now working on the final draft of At the Mercy of the Devil, which was previously known as The Devil of Brooklyn Manor, before I start sending my manuscript to agents. Safe to say I am not okay. <laughs> the trauma reactions are through the roof. I am an absolute mess. I, I'm an anxiety riddled ball of panic attack at the minute who does not get the proper amount of sleep that she should, even with melatonin. <laughs> Draft five in terms of word count was higher than I wanted it to be. It's not catastrophic. I'm not gonna say a number just for my own comfort, <laughs> but it is way too high. However, I have multiple things that I think that I can cut out to lower word count. Would that make it where I, I Ideally want it to be? No. Because frankly, I need more words than that to tell the story. Even if I went just full on first draft, no detail, nothing, it would still end up being higher than, I guess, the industry standard. Very simply because this story is that long. I have a bunch of notes in here on how I want to cut it down, topics that I want to remove, characters that I want to remove, or is a character. No, in this draft is one character that I want to remove. I was thinking of the character that I cut last draft that are all going to be gone. They were a minor character, but they took space anyway. And I think I want to remove, well, I'm pretty sure I want to remove, where are these freaking notes? Um, <laughs> a certain plot aspect? 
can I can rework the story without it being there. How much of this do I have planned? Nothing. <laughs> I I'm much better when it comes to winging these kinds of things. I also still haven't found my notes. So act two is where I need to cut the majority of words, which means from chapter 18 to chapter 52. That's the main problem area. When I break act two down in part one and part two, meaning the part before the midpoint and after, it's, it's still equal. It's both exactly 33K. That's good. However, <laughs> that makes for a combined 67,000 words in Act 2. That is too much. It's simply too much. So I need to go in and cut down whatever really I can. I have been cutting. I have been cutting. Some chapters more than others, but I don't think I've really ended up with a chapter... But in the end, didn't have some words cut. I'm cutting. I'm over a thousand words that I've already cut. I've edited a total of one, two, three, four, eight chapters. Make it for a total of 11,000 words. Well, almost 12,000. I should say 12,000. 12,000 words. It used to be a lot more. Okay, I think this is gonna have to do for now. <laughs> Whatever. I just got a little on my chair. No, I don't have to sit like hunched back and posture down. <laughs> so I ended up hanging out with a friend of mine for a bit while doing some writing. I finished not much because my pen was simply getting too bad for me to continue. But we did do some writing. Sad part of it is that I had to actually add some words. Which is not great. I was hoping I wouldn't have to add any to these scenes, but... Well, I knew that this particular scene, although I didn't realize it was that scene when I started writing, needed some words added. But I had to take those words from another scene that I ended up cutting. That original scene was almost 400 words. I added to this scene, if this even makes sense at this point, <laughs> around 100. So it could be a lot worse. I'm counting it as a win. Um, oh god, what am I doing? Jesus. For now, because it is officially after six, I'm gonna eat soon. Probably not ready again until later tonight. And in the meantime, game. Because Pembrain is refusing to work along with me here. And I feel quite awful at the minute. <laughs> so, yeah. I'm also anxiously waiting for an email from my therapist. <laughs> my internet was out all day, well, all evening, two nights ago now when I was supposed to have an online appointment with her. Emailed her as soon as the internet came back on, like, hey, can we make a new uh, appointment? She hasn't responded yet to that email. Usually she's quite fast with answering emails, so now my anxiety is going ham about the fact that she hasn't responded yet. <laughs> Until that time, I'm gonna 
numb myself <laughs> with video games. That's the plan for the rest of the evening. I do need to take a shower at some point. Maybe join a brickle, but that is going to depend on how much energy I have. I don't know if this is just a dip in energy that I'm having right now, or if this is how it's going to stay the rest of the day. I'm hoping it's a dip. Because if it's not, that's going to suck. We'll honestly just have to see. I don't know. I don't know what this is going to look like the rest of the day, so. Video games for now. Rest later. Could I look like any more of a mess? No, probably not. But to be fair, it is almost 2 a.m. Am I just about to start writing? Yes. Don't judge me, alright? <laughs> I don't need to be judged. It's been two days. Mainly because yesterday I didn't do much in terms of writing. I finished one scene. I think it was one scene that I managed to finish yesterday. Ish. 300 words of that scene. And that's mostly all the writing that I did. Not great. Could also be a hell of a lot worse. Considering... I'm still in the middle of PEM, so hey, writing is writing, and we're gonna leave it at that. Now I am on to the second perspective, meaning that for part two, perspective one is finished. I did make some preparations for the scene that I'm about to start editing now, which is the first chapter for perspective two. I want to merge two scenes together for this uh, chapter. One scene is 1,232 words. The other one, 387. <laughs> so quite a difference. Initially, actually, this was one scene, and I think it was last draft that I was like, oh no, this should probably be two scenes because I want to give this a bit, a bit more attention and now that I have read over it I'm like why the frick is this two scenes this is taking up words that don't need to it just doesn't need to be two scenes <laughs> I read through the shorter scene yesterday and kind of took notes of the important bits, I can literally just take all of that and condense it into a tiny bit of... What's the word? Dialogue. I can condense it into a tiny bit of dialogue between the two characters. Maybe a smidge to hint at what is originally in the shorter scene. And that'll be enough. I don't think I need the full 300-ish words that are there. I think I can condense it to about 150. And then, obviously, hopefully, condense, uh, the merged scene and get a lower word count than what I started at. So lower, ideally, although I don't know if it's doable, lower than 1,232 words. That's, that's if La La Land exists. Why do I do this to myself? Writing is slowly taking me to the edge of insanity. Very slowly. So, <laughs> this thing is actually a hot water bottle. It's huge. But, it's long enough that it fits beautifully right on my spine, like the whole length of it, which is where I have most of my fibromyalgia. 
It's such a relief. Back to what I do with a bunny. Keep pretty stared and over my back. <laughs> I see how that works. It's just staring into the camera. It's just creepily staring, like. Well, everything I'm putting has officially been merged. What babe? Which means I can get rid of you. It's favorably. It's favorably. It's fine. Oh, he's still growling. Oh. <laughs> you dead? No. <laughs> I made it quite a way for my doing. Through the devil of a man. No. At the mercy of the devil. Fuck. Fuck this. <laughs> So if you made it to the end of the video, thank you so much for watching. I will see you very, very soon, and I hope you have a nice day.